Broadcaster Darren Hinch is making his way into Melbourne on the last leg of his Jail to Justice walk. Some of Australia's most prominent victims of crime have joined him in demanding a national public register of sex offenders. Laurel Irving has the details. Good morning, Anne. Yes, the walk started this morning at Brunswick, very close to the spot where Jill Ma was taken off the streets and raped and murdered, and will continue through street, city streets to Victoria's State Parliament, where Darren Hinch expects to have meetings with senior government ministers. He'll be joined along the way by victims of crime, many of them parents of murder victims, including Bruce and Denise Morecambe, who've come down from Queensland, of course, in the memory of their son Daniel, and Rosie Batty, Luke Batty his mother. Darren Hinch began this walk 10 days ago. He called it jail to justice. He started outside the Langy Calcal jail where he spent 50 days earlier this year for breaching a suppression order in the Jill Mar case uh, and he's campaigning for tougher parole conditions for criminals, longer sentences and for a national sex offenders register to be set up. The thing I believe here is that since the, the, the Daniel Morecambe case and since uh, the sentencing and since Jill Mar's murder not far from here, I think the rage has been maintained. I think now people say, like they did in the, like Peter Finch in the movie, we're fed up, we're not going to take it anymore. We're there to back up Darren and really encourage people to come along, come to Spring Street, Victoria Parliament House, join us in the protest and really make a stand because we want to make a difference. Darren's about making sure Australia is a great place to raise a kid, a very safe place, and we're backing that up. Now, Darren Hinch expects the walk to reach Parliament a little after midday, where he'll have those meetings with those ministers. He'll also present them with a petition with more than 100,000 signatures calling for that sex offenders register to be established. And